Let's get now to our China Brief. It's a look at the stories making headlines in newspapers and online. A commentary in the Economic Daily says China should use fiscal funds more efficiently. That says some local governments continue to face notable funding shortages. The Daily says that governments should use their investments to guide more private capital into sectors that are key to China's economic development. Yep, certainly a little bit more signs of what this means for fiscal policy. And meanwhile, it's quite interesting. There's a job ad that's been circling around online at a supermarket in China that's generating a lot of buzz here right now. So that's because it comes with an age requirement between 18 to 30 years old. And that's lower than 35, which is sometimes seen as the unofficial cutoff age for potential employers. It also comes, of course, as China grapples with slowing economic growth. There's an aging population, youth unemployment, which we talked about as well, Heidi, time and time again. All right, what does this mean, right? At least one user on Weibo says they're above the age of 35 and they're experiencing issues in job hunting right now, while others note that the so-called lucky ones We'll have to nail down everything between 20 to 30, including getting a job, getting married, and having a child. Yeah, I, I, I'm not a big fan of age limits when it comes to looking for jobs, Heidi. Just goes to show, I mean, I don't know. We, we should just stay at Bloomberg for some time. <laughs> this is just this is giving me anxiety about how much uh, you know, the right? expectations are piling on in a country where we know the demographics are not in favor, right? People are having less kids in China, despite you know all of the sort of policy support to try and convince them <laughs> otherwise to build the population. But like this is the second ranked post on Weibo at the moment, 74 million views, over 8,000 comments, and it's interesting, Yvonne, you talk about th this happens in the context of youth unemployment. Right. We know that last summer youth unemployment numbers were hitting record highs. So I don't know, is, is putting a, a tight range when it comes to specifications, you can I guess, one way you can to always to widen the age net people. a little bit more. Right. Yeah. <laughs> just it's fine. Thirty five is fine. Right. Even even higher. Just open up the possibilities. <laughs> 50 is a new 40, 40 is a new 30, age is yes. just a number, etc. Of course. Et cetera.